Welcome back. If you're thinking of staying in on this chilly Sunday, how about some cookies? These smell great. Magpie's Bakery. Elizabeth is here um, to show us how to make these perfect chocolate cherry chewy cookies. I like yes. this. Chewy, chewy cherry. Alliteration. Mm. <laughs> all right, we've got all our ingredients yes. out. How do we get started here? All right, so you're going to start with about three cups of powdered sugar. All right, three <coughs> cups of powdered yeah, sugar. So put that Ooh, in the bowl. Yeah. Yes. Came out there. Yes. When we're both wearing black. Yeah, I know. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> Wrong choice. <laughs> um, so I've got about uh, three quarters of a cup of uh, cocoa powder and then a cocoa quarter powder. teaspoon of salt. Okay, and that's the salt's mixed in there yes, already? Yes, Okay. Is. And so we'll just start uh, whisking that around. If mm -hmm. you wanted to pour in these egg whites. So I've got the whites of three to four eggs, just kind of depending on uh, how large your eggs are. Alright. Yeah. So we'll just whisk that around until it's smooth. It takes a little Ooh. bit of time. If you have a KitchenAid mixer or a hand mixer, that. they're a little bit easier. Or if you need the workout, you yeah. know, your arm. Yeah. Everybody's trying to get in shape in yes. January. I always feel like my arm gets tired when I'm whisking. That's when I'm like, all right, I gotta, I gotta pull out the mixers because I, I get lazy. No, you know, the time of the year to start moving your arms. Or if you need something active for the kids on a day when it's like cold or they don't want to be outside, be like, hey, let's bake some cookies. We're gonna put you to work. Yeah. <laughs> and then you make them do all the mixing, right? <laughs> yes. I think I like that. Ooh, and I can yeah, start to plan. see it's yes. kind of getting gooey yeah, already. Yeah, it's almost like a brownie. Um, it looks like a brownie. It does look like brownie batter. Yeah. So once you start seeing that dark chocolate Thick. color, yeah. then you can add in your uh, mini chocolate chips and your cho uh, cherries. And these are just like dried they cherries? They are dried cherries, yeah. yes. Okay, how so many pour those in. do you put in there, just kind of based on how much you want? Um, it, yeah, it can be. I would say we put in about a cup of cherries and three quarters of a cup of chocolate chips. Now do the little baby chocolate chips do better than like larger chunks? Yes, they do. Um, these cookies are, you can see they're really chunky, so I think yeah. the, the little ones kind of spread evenly throughout. Yeah, a better, little bit so. better. Yep, so oh, then wow, once, how thick it yeah, is. it's super thick. So now we'll scoop them onto the stream. Okay, get your ice cream scooper. Yep. Super easy, really chunky. And that small little scoop is gonna make this big old cookie. Yes, yep. Wow, they spread. that's actually pretty impressive. Um, the cool thing about these is they're actually uh, gluten-free as well. So really? if you're trying to avoid gluten or you have yeah. an allergy, these are really nice. It's really easy, and I know there's a lot of people that either have kind of those health restrictions that are trying to in the new year do something yes. a little healthier. And everybody, you know, when you have a sweet tooth, you, you miss that good mm -hmm. stuff. But there are other options. Yeah, and one to of make the I mean, accessible. one of these is it's not that bad for you. Definitely, like. those yeah. look amazing. Now, are these at the bakery right now? Or are these just they a special are, treat for this these, morning? We have these daily. We daily, them daily, yes. Oh my gosh, and there you, you guys go. You can also find them at Three Rivers Market as well. Awesome. And you guys are closed today on Sundays, but you reopen tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Where can people find you guys if they want to pop by? So we are open um, 10 o'clock every day, Monday through Saturday at 846 North Central Street. And if you can't find us at the bakery, then you can go to Kroger and Cedar Bluff. Excellent. Okay, so once these are all done, we'll do our TV magic. How long yeah. are we going to pop them in the oven for? Um, 350 for 10 to 12 minutes. 350, 10 to 12 minutes, and then you pull them out, maybe let them cool for a bit. Yeah, let them cool 5, and 10 voila. minutes. And then that's those look fun. so good. I'm just amazed at how chunky they yeah, are. I know, they're really good. They're chunky a hearty cookie. Chunky and gooey. Maybe if you're looking for something to make for the football, uh, game tonight or at Super Bowl, you either order them from you guys mm -hmm. or try it in your own kitchen. Elizabeth, yep. thank you for being thank here. You for having me. We appreciate it. We'll put that recipe online as well if you want to check it out. 